please give it up for Nori Davis! Hey, hey. Gang, 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 gang. <laughs> What's up, Brooklyn? How you doing? Fire, fire. I'm from Yonkers, New York. Um, hey, thank you. Hey, if you can give me a ride, I appreciate it. It's so far. It's two hours outside of Brooklyn, and I used to always bum a ride to the subway to go hang out in the city, but I recently discovered this new train called Metro North. You ever heard of this train? <laughs> All right, so people that don't know Metro North, right, it's basically like the subway, but there's no dicks. <laughs> there's no dicks, there's no panhandling. It's clean, and it's $11. <laughs> and the subway's $2.75. So for $8.25 more, you're treated like a fucking human being. <laughs> you are a person. Cause we all know the grind in New York. When you on the subway, somebody's like, yo, man, you got any money? And I always want to tell them, like, look, we're broke, too. <laughs> That's why we on here. <laughs> now, what you need to do is go Metro North. <laughs> Them niggas got money. They paid $11. Why are you asking me? Why the poor back in the poor? <laughs> I always want to tell those tumbling kids, man, they go on that Connecticut line. Go to Connecticut or Metro North, man, them white women be like, oh, do you take Freedom Chase? <laughs> yes, ma'am, we have the square. $8.25. <laughs> whole new world, whole different system. On uh, Metro North, they have this HR person called a conductor. <laughs> so nice. They smile and they tell you to stop. We'll be making stops to Riverdale and Yonkers. Voice so soft, sound like a yoga instructor. <laughs> and when we pass Yonkers, make sure your chakras are aligned and you're breathing. <laughs> are you breathing? <gasps> yeah, I'm breathing. <laughs> and then when we get on the subway, they scream at us <laughs> like they're our father. Don't hold the door! <laughs> Who's holding the door? <laughs> and I get so much anxiety, I look at the intercom, I'm like, I don't know. I don't, I don't know, I just got here, I don't know. I'll turn this train around, I don't give a fuck. No, no, no. I want to go downtown, not uptown. Are you holding the door? You with your dick out, do you have the door open? Can we communicate? Eight dollars and 25 cents. You're a human being. On Metro North, you can drink liquor. You could drink liquor on there, and the women drink their wine like, mm, I've never seen a dick. <laughs> and the conductor's like, you never will, more and more low. <laughs> Enjoy your ride to Westchester. <laughs> uh. And women in the subway see a dick every day, man. I feel so bad. It's like, you didn't pay $2.75 for that. <laughs> it's almost like every time a woman gets a, me a Metro card, there should be an asterisk like, oh, you might see a dick. <laughs> and she's like, no, I don't want to. It's like, oh, no, it's complimentary. <laughs> it's on us. Enjoy your penis. Bye. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> it's like, I want wine. I'm really excited for my mother. My mother just retired 32 years as a public school teacher, man. Shout out to any teachers out there. Thank you. Thank you. 
Thank you. I'll tell her you care. <laughs> of course, man. It's, it's so interesting, man. I have such a warm place in my heart for teachers that retire, man. It's, it's different contrast to where, like, somebody in the NBA retires, their jerseys in the rafters, and they're like, all right, I had a good time. I enjoyed my career. Bye. When a teacher or somebody in local government retires, they're just like, I'm done. <laughs> Do you want to party? No. <laughs> this never happened. <laughs> Fuck those kids. This never happened. They don't appreciate me. <laughs> She's so jaded. And I feel bad that she jaded because I feel teachers are celebrities, man, but we don't treat them as such. We don't. They are. They are celebrities, man. They all, we, we're all here today because we remember our first grade teacher, our second grade teacher. You know how these celebrities, you remember you was little, you see your teacher out in public and you freak out? <laughs> like, Mr. Burner, what you doing out here with shorts on? <laughs> Why you got your ankles out? What the fuck you doing? Oh, no, you know, I'm just going to the beach. No, you live in school. <laughs> Fuck you doing outside? <laughs> you never thought they had a life. I thought my teacher just go back into the cubby and recharge. <laughs> it's 8.30. How you doing, class? <laughs> oh, I knew you was back there. That's Mr. Burno. <laughs> they a celebrity. And that's my mom. My mom's a local celebrity. You know, I'll take her out to the movies, and every time I take her out, she'll run into some grown-ass man <laughs> that she taught in second grade, and he can't contain himself. Yo, Miss Davis! Miss Davis! You remember me? You re that's my second grade teacher. You remember me? And my mother acts like a celebrity that doesn't want to be bothered. <laughs> Hello, Trey. <laughs> How are you, Trey? <laughs> that boy can't read for shit. <laughs> Hi, baby. <laughs> Yo, Miss David, let me get an autograph. No, baby, you can't read. I remember. <laughs> it's all right. I'm going to go see Black Panther. Bye-bye. You guys are dope, man. I'm Nori Davis, man. Thank you so much.